Hello, Man of the Mayhem here and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be looking at my cybersecurity and IT go bag. So, this is the bag that I take to work with me every day, that I have in the classroom with me, and whenever I go do some IT work or cybersecurity work, this is the bag that goes with me. It means I can have one bag that I can just quickly grab and have everything that I need. So let's get into it. Inside this top layer I have got two 2.5 inch hard drives. One of these is running a Medicat, one of these is just a loot drive. Uh, I use these just because they are easy to get hold of and I've got plenty of them. Next to them I have also got a USB 3A mail to a set of power and a set of data so I can actually turn these hard drives straight into uh, USB portable storage. Next to that I have got a SanDisk 1TB drive with a USB-C and usb a adapter. This is also just for loot and moving stuff about. Now on to our next layer. This is the main layer of the bag and this is where I've got most of the stuff that I kind of use while I'm in the classroom or when I'm trying to kind of troubleshoot things and fix things. Along this side here I've got multiple USB sticks with different operating systems ranging from Windows Server to EXSI, Proxmox. I've also got some Linux systems in there like a live boot of Kali, Linux Mint, and other things. Uh, this particular drive here that's wrapped in tape is using the SCAR virus scanner tester. I have a USB-C to RJ45 Ethernet adapter, a USB-A to RJ45 Ethernet adapter for whenever I'm testing networks with different devices. I've got one, two, three USB micros. I did have a USB mini in here for doing console and switches but that seems to have gone missing. I've got an Apple Thunderbolt to USB-C cable just here and USB-A to USB-C as well. So basically anytime that I need to re-image a machine or get anything done I can just do that from there. On this next side of the bag is a bit of a jumble. So here I have my Wi-Fi Alpha dual band 2.4 and 5 GHz Wi-Fi adapter. That goes to USB-A mail and that comes with two plus 5 dB Wi-Fi antennas. I've then got a Hack5 Wi-Fi pineapple and this comes with the standard free Wi-Fi adapters. I can actually use the Wi-Fi Alpha in conjunction with this to make it so that I can do it across 2.4 and 5 GHz networks rather than just the 2.4 that you can do with this. I have a USB-C to USB-C cable. This is what goes with the actual, um, this is what goes with the Wi-Fi pineapple. And I have an RJ45 basic Ethernet connector in A mode and I have a cat5 cable as well this next bit's a bit messy so what I'll probably do is put the bag to one side and then show you each component on the actual table so in this next section I have got a SD card reader micro and full size I have, I have got a couple of spare USB sticks for whatever what may uh, depending on what I'm kind of doing moving stuff around or if I have to create new boot sticks I have a 128 gigabyte loot USB stick as well. Uh, this particular USB stick is currently holding some crypto miners, so if I need to run these scripts for some machines to turn into crypto miners, I can do. Of course, I only do this on my own devices. I've got a collection of various adapters between USB A, USB C, USB Micro, so I can convert each device that I've got to kind of anything that I need to be able to do. I have a micro SD card reader with a micro SD card in it. I have an ESP8266 Wi-Fi deauthor, a USB Bluetooth stick, uh, a RJ45 to RJ45, as small as I can make it as a bit of a joke with my friend. I have a USB-A to USB-A keylogger. I have a USB stick that also contains tails. And last but not least is my bad USB made by Maltronix, uh, which is the Malduino. This has got a USB-A on one side, usb see on the other and can be accessed wirelessly through your phone to be able to run commands. And that's the end of that section there. Now we're moving on to the last part of the bag. So in the last part of the bag there's two sides. On this side we have got a HDMI to USB capture card which I can use with my Raspberry Pis or any devices that I seem to be working on. I've also got a USB-C anchor dock that works with my surfaces and my laptop. On this side we have got a 4G wireless router, 
we have got another 3G wireless router, but this one can take an SD card to make a file server. But an old mobile phone that I use for wall driving, and I also have NetHunter Kelly Linux on there as well. I have a Bluetooth foldable keyboard and mouse to use with my Raspberry Pis or any other devices that I need to. A Raspberry Pi 3B Plus. This is running uh, Kelly Linux, and it has also got and it's got Netcat set up on it, so I can actually get remote shell and leave this on site as a Dropbox. I then have my Raspberry Pi 5 8 gig that is running Kelly Linux, and this is just for me to use out and about. So that is most of the stuff that's inside of my cybersecurity and IT go bag. It pretty much gives me everything that I could ever possibly need to be able to troubleshoot any problems or to do some basic Wi-Fi or other penetration testing. Hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to join me next time. Thanks very much. Cheers.